Hi, my name is Megan Paul with Events in the City, and I'd like to take just a minute today to talk to you about how to tackle your reception design. Step one is to go ahead and look at your event space and break it into three manageable bites. The first being to think on a broad spectrum. Thinking about lighting and utilizing that is a great way to create a welcoming environment. Using soft hues or amber tones is very warm and romantic. The next step would be to think about music. Don't underestimate its power. If you're looking for your guests to come right in and jump on the dance floor, then I'd recommend a very upbeat and lively tune. If you'd like guests to more take their seats, perhaps slow it down a little bit. One of the other options is to use varied height centerpieces. If you have highs and lows, it allows your eyes to grab onto something instead of just scanning across the room. Step two is to look at the overall table design. Using interesting chairs, patterned linens is a great way to draw your guests in. Once you get them there, what are they going to see? Let's use different shaped tables. Using a creative and interesting floor plan allows guests to see that you've thought about it and it's an easy way to reflect the type of reception that you'd like to have. Step three is to go to the individual guest place setting. Perhaps by using customized menus, chargers, or creative fun place cards shows guests again that you've thought about them. They're going to be spending a good amount of time here. You might as well make it as detailed as possible so that they have lots to touch, see, and experience. Speak with your caterers about potential upgrades. They might be more affordable than you think. By following these simple guidelines, you can create what we like to call 3, 2, 1, Impact.